hello and welcome to another tutorial that might we see we will continue the tutorial of using Windows Server 2008 but in this episode we would be going a little further into the use of the DNS server this time adding the IIS 6.0 or web server using this to add a website so let's start so we go to start administrative tools and we go to DNS within the whole lookup zone click the add sign until on domain of ac.com <laughs> and right here you can simply add new words this was you can probably put web IP address 192.168.1 that on drive in all our previous tutorials we are using 192.1.8.0 so this is just a little clarification to make sure there are no crashes and we are creating the associated pointer so you click on those that's successfully created okay <laughs> So you see web here. You're going to be a close look of zone. You can see web here and the uh, IP address given to it. So in order to use this, we come up with a follow later. So now we need to add the web server. So we will be going to add roles, server roles, and selected web server or IIS. We just need to add new features, so add your five features. So next, this just gives you the basic description of what web server does. So we click next. Now we have a lot of standard settings here. It will run using the standard settings. So which will be HTTP, iPod, text transfer protocol, which is or would run on the internet. So you'll see all HTTP more or less highlighted here. We go through the list and see security. This can be added later for a stricter policy. What I'll also like to add is the FTP. So you can add the rules. But for now, this will make it a little longer to install. So I'll come back to that. But this FTP publishing service will be very useful because it will give you an, another way of referencing your website. But for now, you click next and leave all standard settings as is. And you click install. Alright, now that web server successfully installed, and click close here. Right. For this tutorial, we will be using Civil 2008 and we will be testing it on the actual system which will be Windows 2007 running on this laptop here. Let's try to find Windows 7 
Bueno, no son ciertos sueños. La curso de gato no estaba no con eso. Let's test to see that. It's just really interesting. So, we'll start with my thumb. And we're supposed to be reading. No. Ping. Crazy. So. Okay, we have it there. And. From here we can. Ping. PC. Seven. Touch PC. So, what are we planning? So, we have communication. So, from this one is seven. You can actually use Explorer and look for it. So, we are going to enter 192.168.168. Add zero dot one, and there we have it. The web page. If we go for the computer's name being PC server, we also get the same web page. So that's just a basic explanation of the other web page. There is also several ways of putting on security codes or if you want the user to be able to upload. That is where you would go to. When we so when you go to our services, you will actually go back to the original screen you are installing. And if you install FTP, this actually would give the user the ability to upload and other things on your page. Well, that's just my brief tutorial showing you how to use DNS. Reverse the pop soon and adding a website all using Windows Server 2008. Thanks very much.